up everybody welcome back to another last rafts baseball video today it is day two of our yamuri giants box break uh yesterday we did five packs from the box today we're going to do another five more packs from the box and uh we're taking a look at uh, some of the things that we want to try to uh, to get we haven't found an autograph or a relic yet but we did find one of the inserts yesterday, numbered out of 100, the Her Gerardo Pereira uh, card, the facsimile signature parallel numbered out of 100. So today we're going to start again and break our packs. A couple things about the Emory Giants. I was talking yesterday. The Emory the Giants have been around since 1936, and they've won 37 Central League titles. And then, of course, they've won 22 Japan Series title. And before they called it the Japan Series, they called it the, um, they called it the Japanese League title. So combined, since 1936, they've won 31 championships. And as I mentioned, they're kind of the New York Yankees of uh, Japanese baseball. And um, unfortunately for them, their last titles come in 2012. So it's been, uh, well, eight years this year since they've uh, won their last uh, championship. So we're going to uh, crack into this and see what we can pull and uh, what we can get. And obviously yesterday, uh, pulling the uh, Gerardo Pereira, uh, he is one of their import players this year. Um, obviously, Baby Shark fame, Washington national player, winning a World Series last year and now taking his trade over to the land of the rising sun. And so we start off with an outfielder, Kaito uh, Murakami. Kaito Murakami. And uh, our second card is one of these uh, Futurity Star, and this is Dai Yuasa. In fact, I think we pulled the, a Dai Yuasa yesterday. Futurity, I didn't know that that was a word, but uh, we'll stay with it and stick with it. We've got a Yuki Takahashi, Yuki Takahashi. And then our next card is a, um, a Ri, uh, Ryusei O, oh, and... Um, uh, the Giants seem to like the landscape cards. And then the next card we have, we have another Tokyo Culture card. And this, of course, is, we saw one of these yesterday. So there's a uh, Jinjiro uh, Sumatani. And I'm trying to cut the glare out by moving around a bit. Kind of a neat card, catching over one of the bridges. I don't know what bridge that is uh, in Tokyo. And then, of course, we got another landscape card. And we have a Hayato Horioka. And back to the outfielder that we pulled with the first card. So that's pack number one down. And we got four more to go. So pack number two. Pull out our scissors, our trusty scissors. Snip across the top. Murray Giants have had a number of uh, former ex-Big League players, and we mentioned yesterday uh, a few names. Uh, obviously, Jesse Barfield and Lloyd Mosby, two uh, Blue Jays, and of course Barfield also with the Yankees, Mosby with the Tigers, went and played over there. But um, a couple other names that people might recognize. Dan Gladden of Minnesota Twin fame. He played in uh, in, in Tokyo or in, for your Murray for a while. Uh, Gabe Kapler, who I think is now the manager of the San Francisco Giants, who was the manager of the Phillies most recently, uh, applied his trade there. Uh, here's uh, Kayuski Takaji. Kayuski Takaji. And there is another Gerardo Para. So not, you can't have too many North American cards. And we got another Para card because those seem to be the ones that on this side of the water people are interested. And there's a Takumi uh, Oshiro, a genealogy of number. And our next one, we have another landscape view card, and this is Shun Ikeda. Shun Ikeda. And uh, then we have a uh, infielder. We have Yusahiro uh, Yamamoto. Yusahiro Yamamoto. And then we have a Revengers card, Naoki uh, Yoshikawa. And here we'll take a look at the back of that again. And there's a picture, and that's uh, obviously within the 81 of the set. That gives you the Giants. Uh, actually, 1934 was the what they're saying was the first year. 34, 36 on uh, information that we're finding on the internet. But if it's 34, it's 34. They also used to be known as the Tokyo Baseball Club at one point in time, many moons ago. So here comes pack number three. As we throw it around a little bit, toss it around. Pack number three. And 
Uh, other players uh, that uh, have graced the uh, the uniforms in Tokyo, um, also Davy Johnson, former manager of the Mets. Uh, he spent some time playing in Japan as a, as a player, you know, former second baseman, uh, uh, a big league second baseman. And then uh, you've got um, Bill Gullickson. Bill Gullickson pitched. I remember Bill Gullickson. He was with uh, I was with uh, the Expos, and then I think he was with uh, Cincinnati, and then he came back and he was with uh, Houston. Got traded to Detroit in uh, 1991 and he was solid he was outstanding for the tigers that year they tried that was they tried to make a run they had cecil fielder in their lineup they were over in japan digging out some players to bring back uh christopher uh chris Otomo, i don't recognize him he's a latin fellow i'm not sure where uh where he's from uh kota yamashida kota yamashida and then we have a rookie ryu ota a right-handed pitcher and we follow that up with uh, Kiyosuke uh, Miyaguni. And our next card, we have a uh, the next guys. And this is, uh, is an insert. And this is a Kota Yamashita. Kind of a neat looking insert. Uh, as I say, they like the shiny stuff. There's the Yamari Giants. Next guys, 1934 on the back. Uh, his name and his specs. And then lastly, we have a uh, Natino de Plan. Again, another fellow I don't know. Looks like a, a Latin player uh, in their midst. They have a number of guys that are... Uh, that are so Christopher Mercedes. Christ, it looks like Christopher Cristomo Mercedes. Not sure where he's from or, or where, he's, where he's at. We'll take a look and see uh, where they've uh, acquired him from. Sometimes they get players out of the... Uh, Dominican and Venezuelan uh, winter leagues that will come and play there. And um, obviously, uh, just because you are uh, you might play in the big leagues doesn't always guarantee that you're going to get a spot somewhere else. Sometimes the Latin players or the Cuban players in particular will find a home in Japan. Um, we've got a pitcher. We've got Yuki Takahashi. Yuki Takahashi. And then another sideways card. We have Saije Tahara. Saije Tahara. And we got another uh, Futurity, but this is the first time we've seen Koda Yamashita. Koda Yamashita Futurity star. Uh, and then we have uh, Yoshia Matsui. We've seen him before. And then we have a Hiroti Nakaj uh, Nakajima. And then a Kaz Taguchi, Kazuto Taguchi. One thing about these cards, and I can't help but thinking it, the stripes that run down the middle of the card here, right down the middle of the card, for me, this looks like a barcode. <laughs> it looks like I'm taking the back of the card and I need to get this scanned somewhere and it's going to tell me the price. And that's what that these cards are kind of looking like. So I don't know. Uh, tell me if you like it. Uh, to me, it's. I don't know if this is one of my favorite designs. Uh, they, somehow they let an artist get in there and and uh, kept the baseball people aside, and they were trying to make some cool little little thing. But I'm not a big fan of the uh, the barcode running down the middle of the card because that's what it sort of looks like. Okay, here's our last pack, and our last pack. And I noticed on the back uh, they have. Uh, if you want to go to BBM's website, www.bbm-japan.com. I don't know what you can find there. I haven't been there myself. It would be kind of neat to go and take a peek at that. Maybe I'll do that in between. Uh, this video and the one that we'll show you tomorrow and see what we can find and looks like on the back of the card we've got an insert but we'll find out in a moment and on the front we have a special card so there's uh shunasaki yamasi catcher uh their longtime catcher uh, uh shunasaki abi uh, retired at the end of last year last year there is uh nobutaka imamura nobutaka imamura and then in the middle we have uh, Jose Takara, Jose Takara, and then we have a, a Yohei uh, Kagia. Okay, oh right, yeah, we got another one. We've got a uh, Hayato Sakamoto. Sakamoto. I wonder if this one's numbered on the back. I don't. I just don't. Oh, it is. It's numbered out of fifty. So we pulled out two. Last uh, the last uh, box. With the carp, we only got one of these cards, and here we've got two now. So this is the second one. Maybe we got a hot box on our hands, 
And we've got the, uh, of course, the, the signature and, of course, uh, Herrera Pereira over here. And then uh, last but not least, we have uh, Heiato Sakamoto, uh, Road to 2000, 1000 hit uh, versus the Cebu Lions uh, in, uh, all right, in 2014. So he's got to be approaching, uh, approaching that. And so this is a part of the regular set. So G80 tells us that that is the case. And so oh, there's another one for us. So now we can put him up Sakamoto next to Parara. And uh, yeah, there we go. And hey, guess what? That looks pretty familiar. Pretty close to being pretty familiar. I wonder if it's the same uh, same sign. Hard to tell. Well, listen, if you enjoyed the video, um, please give us a thumbs up. And if you're new here, uh, hit the subscribe button because we got a couple more of these videos coming up. And uh, leave us a comment in the comment section. If you think it looks like a barcode running down the middle, <laughs> uh, tell us. Or uh, tell us what you think of the design of the cards. Um, but certainly a lot more landscape cards in this batch than we've seen before. But uh, listen, I want to thank everybody again for taking the time to watch our video. This is another Last Crafts Baseball video production. Have a great day, everybody.